we're still still at a loss. I mean, we're still in shock. Even on the day of the funeral, reality is still sinking in for many family members. Hundreds lined up outside Apostolic Church of God to say goodbye to Jennifer Hudson's mother, Darnell, brother Jason, and her seven-year-old nephew, Julian King. It gave us some form of closure. But most of all, we're just going to keep praying and God's going to take care of everything. It was hard to see a mother and, and uh, her children. You know, that that's a hard thing. Darnell Donerson and Jason Hudson were found shot to death in their Inglewood home October 24th. Julian King's body was found shot in the head inside the family SUV on the west side three days later. The 45 caliber pistol used in the murders was recovered about a block away from where little Julian was found. The Reverend Jesse Jackson and others at today's funeral called for tougher gun laws. People must close ranks and not just mourn, but also organize and fight back to stop the uh, the full of the killing machine. Jennifer Hudson's brother-in-law, William Balfour, is a person of interest in the murders. He's being held on a parole violation. The private funeral was by invitation only, and special tickets were needed to enter the church. Oprah, Mayor Daly, and several celebrity actors and singers were among those in attendance. Although criminal charges have not been filed in this case, family members say they're holding on to hope. But the police is going to do their job, so we just got to keep faith in Jesus. On the south side, Alex Perez, NBC5 News.